What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. I am of course CM Puma and wherever you may be and however you may be watching. Thanks for making this video a part of your day. This uh, The videos have been far and few between, but uh, we got some 2K19 stuff going on today and we are going to get right into it. This video is going to be about the DLC, the season pass for WWE 2K19. So all of the season pass information was uh, released to us and now we know what all is going to be in it. So instead of having this blank image of everything, we now have the uh, ability to see everything. So for $29.99, you'll get 11 new characters, tons of new moves, and special My Player Boost, as it says there on the image. Now, you, of course, you'll always get the accelerator where you can immediately unlock everything, adjusting rankings and attributes. Uh, this is always one of my favorite parts of it, just to go ahead and get through it and unlock it. Um, and then after that, we have your My Player Kickstart, where it gives your guy a little bit of a boost. Last year's My Player was uh, quite lame, in my opinion. Uh, you weren't even able to you weren't able to do a whole lot of stuff in it. And then when it was over, it was over. It was just match after match. There's no story or anything like that. We get a lot of voiceover in My Player this year. That is amazing. We haven't had that in quite some time. Moving on, we got some new moves. 50 new moves, including. Jeff Hardy's Atomic Drop into a double leg combo. Tyler Bates' Exploder versus Opponent on the apron. That's pretty neat. Mustafa Ali's Slingshot X Factor. And Matt Hardy and Bray Wyatt's Assisted Twist of Fate and a handful of others. Individually, $3.99. My Player Kickstart, $9.99. And the Accelerator is $4.99. Then we get the Rising Stars pack where it gets into uh, some of those characters that we're going to be able to unlock. Rising Stars Ricochet. How crazy is that? We don't... When did you ever think you'd see Ricochet in a WWE game? That is insane. Mike and Maria Kanellis, Leo Rush, Lacey Evans, Dakota Kai, and Candice LeRae. I'm pretty excited about that one. One thing I found odd was after the entire roster reveal and the DLC, there was no Tommaso Ciampa. I don't know what's going on with that. And that that's a bit disappointing. Um, he, he, was one hell, he is one hell of a character on NXT and it's disappointing that we're not going to have them unless they're going to reveal it later on who knows so we've got uh, those guys and gals in the rising star pack it's good to see that uh, we're not getting a bunch of legends that nobody's ever going to play with then we move on to the titans pack Bobby Lashley back in a WWE game since oh man a long 2008 maybe looking at my games man I don't even know it's been a long long time EC3 that is amazing. And then, of course, the War Raiders, uh, Raymond Rowe and Hanson. Raymond Rowe, probably one of my favorite guys to watch on the quote-unquote indie scene and then going into ROH. Um, he's been at a lot of shows down here in Houston. And uh, my first experience with Raymond Rowe was here in Houston at a local show, and it was just, it was just fantastic. So lots of stuff you're getting for $29.99 instead of spending, let's see, $10, $20, 24 oh 29 39 dollars you're saving some change you're saving some change if you get the season pass of course i recommend getting that season pass if not for all those guys and gals that is amazing so we get all of those things in the season pass i am super pumped about that so all that's coming we've got one uh, other video macho has uh, been gracious enough to let me break down one of his videos and a lot of stuff that I saw. So we will be doing that in the next video that I post. So thank you guys for watching. Peace.